I was going through some old photos the other day and I stumbled upon some pretty ridiculous photos of myself. I could not believe how round my face used to look. I was actually blown away that I used to look like that. It's literally a circle faced shape, not a face shaped face. Since I'm now way leaner, I've realized how much your face can transform just from losing weight. Back then, I didn't think I had any resemblance of defined facial features. I wondered why I was blessed with such poor facial genetics. But it's all so clear now. You're not ugly, you're just fat. And there is a well-defined face hiding underneath all that fat. And it's not just me. Here are a bunch of other dudes who have done the same. So if you feel like you weren't blessed with superior facial genetics, do not worry, my friend there is still hope. You know when you buy a new phone and it comes with like that thin shade of plastic on the front of it? Or like this new watch that I just got and it came with this thin shade of plastic over the screen. Imagine the whole time that you were using the phone or the watch that you just never took the plastic off and you just left it on the screen forever. You'd never get to truly experience the screen in all its glory. Or like when you get a new couch and you know sometimes they come with like this plastic covering over the cushions so you don't damage it during transport. But then you decide to leave that plastic cover on for the entirety of that couch's lifetime and you can never really experience the true comfort and the beauty of that couch. This is what you're doing with your face if you never get lean. By lean, I'm talking like sub 15% body fat because that's when I believe your face really starts to show itself. You might think you're ugly because you don't have a jawline or have high cheekbones. You feel like you have puffy cheeks and you might feel like your parents didn't bless you with any facial genetics. But none of that is true. You're simply just fat. And if your body is fat, your face will be fat. They work the exact same way. It's not your genetics, it is simply human physiology. Your body will distribute any extra body fat evenly across your whole body, including your face. So if you're carrying extra body fat, your face will be round. It will lack depth and 3D-ness. It won't look natural. A normal face is meant to be face shaped, kind of like an oval, not a round circle like mine used to be. If you eat too much food, it'll show on your face. If you eat shit food, inflammatory food, junk food, it shows in your face. If you don't do exercise, you don't get any steps, it'll show on your face. All you need to do is dial in your diet and your exercise so you can get lean and your face will transform. You'll find that you naturally have a defined jawline and cheekbones underneath all the fat. I truly believe that any guy can go from a three to a seven simply by losing fat and revealing his facial structure. The bar is so low right now, since most people are overweight, everyone is so round and puffy that by simply having a defined jawline, you'll stand out like a model. Like it's a pretty crazy world we live in where simply by having a regular shaped face, you'll be perceived as above average. Plus, once you have a lean face, all hairstyles look good on you. You can literally rock anything, like buzz cut, long hair, medium hair, mullets, bowl cuts, whatever the fuck. The reason that so many guys have that typical short on the sides, long on the top haircut that like 90% of guys have is because it works as an optical illusion. It elongates their round faces so that their head looks less of a circle. Imagine you have like a perfect circle and then you just add a bit on top while keeping the sides slip. It'll make the overall shape look less round and more like an oval. And that's the illusion that most guys are trying to achieve with that haircut. But when your face is actually face shaped like an oval, you don't need to play these illusion games. A simple buzz cut was all you need or just any cut in general will do nothing but compliment your face. Just ask any professional hairstylist what is the most desirable face shape or the easiest face shape to work with. And they were also oval because it is a regular face shape and it works with most hairstyles. It's the same concept as basic clothing. A fit man in a well-fitting t-shirt will look 10 times better than some chubby dude wearing some gay name brand Gucci shit. The same way that a well-defined face will look 10 times better than some guy trying to get fancy with accessories, jewelries, hats, haircuts, any of that stuff. A lean face gives you the freedom to rock any kind of beard, earrings, glasses, hats, hairstyle, because they will all look good on a well-proportioned face. The last point I want to touch on is, yes, we want to get lean, but it is important that you do it healthily and holistically. There is no point in taking stupid drugs like Ozempic or going on silly salad crash diets where you just starve yourself so you can have a lean face. The whole point is that a lean face should be a healthy byproduct of losing fat naturally. This means eating nutrient dense whole foods most of the time, prioritizing things like meat, eggs, dairy, 
fruit, vegetables. If you just eat whole foods, mostly animal-based most of the time, and you pair that with exercise, like 10,000 steps a day, a bit of strength training, there is no fucking way your face won't get leaner. Trust me, you have a supermodel face waiting to be revealed.